Hello. Miss Joni, how are you? Good. Who's this? This is Gary in Bristol from Kiss Country. Oh, yay! <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> do you know someone named Megan Reeves? I do. Well, it's a good thing because she has told off on you. Oh, no. Oh. I thought you were calling about someone I had nominated. <laughs> what have you nominated somebody for? For the um, weekly what, hero or whatever. Caught in the act. Cockney Act, Cockney Act. Well, uh, funny you should say that because Megan wrote a letter about you and I was hoping I could read it to you. Oh, my God. All right. I'm sitting down. <laughs> <laughs> she says, Miss Joni works as a veterans outreach coordinator at the VA and she goes above and beyond to help our homeless veterans get rehabilitation and back on track for a healthy, successful life. She is with them from the beginning all the way through completion of the program. Miss Joni's help has helped countless veterans and if you ask them she is the most helpful kindest generous and caring person that they've ever met she goes above oh and God. beyond in every way she uses all of the resources available to them and then some she truly has a heart of gold and this is why i am asking you to consider her as this week's kiss country caught in the act award recipient Oh, my goodness. How sweet is that? And that's why you are. Oh. <laughs> you know, a lot that of people... Cry. <laughs> you know, a lot of people don't realize how many homeless veterans we have in our area. That's true. And the fact that we even have those words strung together in a sentence is a crying shame. Mm-hmm. Homeless veteran in the United States of America... Mm -mm. I know, it should never happen. Thank you for what you do. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> How can we help you do what you do? Oh, my goodness. Um, boy, you caught me here off guard. We can always use um, donations of... Um, just uh, food, basically. We have veterans that are uh, moving into new places, uh -huh. and once they move in, they may not have, um, you know, perishable and non-perishable food. Uh, their um, card, their food stamp card might not be uh, activated yet, or it might mm -hmm. be the middle of the month, something like that. Now, is or there organizations that you work with specifically that you would want people to support in, in order to help the homeless veteran population here? Um, it's so complicated. Um, just this willingness to work with us, I guess, and the Bozier Housing Authority, they help a whole lot getting better to help. Yeah. It's it's just, yeah, like you said, it's, it's huge. It's big. And, you know, mm -hmm. whether it's I know, I know the food banks and renesting and, and the hub mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. just so many organizations mm -hmm. are involved in this. And the fact that you're at the ground level working through the VA and with the Veterans Outreach uh, organization, that's just so huge. So thank you, Miss Joni. Well, and we have a Veterans Treatment Court um, here in town. So that's a mainly a big part of what I do as well. Well, people don't know about that a lot of times. Well, the Lord, he, 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 he knew what he was doing with you, sister. Oh, well, thank you so much. Thank you. Well, I got to tell you, <laughs> I mean, it pales in comparison. We could not thank you enough for what you do, but uh, we got you a hundred dollar Silver Star gift card. Oh, that'll be nice. Thank you. <laughs> and of course, all of our thanks and admiration. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. I listen to y'all every morning. Oh, we sure do appreciate you for that. <laughs> <laughs> I love the Star Spangled Banner and the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs> every morning, 645. <laughs>